All right, what's poppin' you too, man? Welcome back. Welcome to day four of Vlogmas. Now, I did miss day three. Only because I had a military bar to go to. For those of y'all who don't know, you feel me? I said it back in the, the vlog. I look a little different. I shave my face, man. Just disregard all that. But um, I said it back in the vlog I did two days ago. I, sh uh, I had a military bar to attend to, so I really couldn't vlog. I couldn't do any recording. That was an all-day type of thing. So I'm, I will be dropping two videos today. You feel me? I'm going to be dropping two videos today. <sighs> so good. I will be dropping two videos today, so I do apologize for the inconsistency on vlogs. But today, I'm going to do a little mukbang, a little mukbang. Y'all let me know how y'all pronounce it. I got the panda wander. This shit looks so delicious. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Look at this shit, bro. Let me get my thumbnail in. Look at that. Look how good that look. I me, mean, I don't wanna spill it. Ah. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Panda Express, if you wanna sponsor this video. For those of y'all who don't know, man, I live off of Panda Express. Panda Express and Wingstop. You feel me? I could live off that shit. But I'm going to do a mukbang. I'm going to pretty much be talking talking about why I stopped doing reactions. You know what I'm saying? Now, for those of y'all who don't know, for those of y'all who just tuning in, reactions is what put this channel into motion. Like I said, I got monetized in like five months man just off of reactions just crazy upload them twice a day once a day three times a day 1k videos you know what i'm saying in an hour like videos in 1k in an hour and that's just how reactions are you feel me reactions blow up quick you get a lot of views and a lot of subs like that but i caught i, I kind of got tired of that you know what i'm saying i've grown out of reactions i look completely different I look like a fucking worm but uh, I grown out of reactions. Before I even tap into this, I gotta assert my dominance because this shit looks so good. So I mean, I I, I gotta spit on this shit. You feel me? Like, let me take this bite. I know that was weird for y'all, but trust me, like the real ones understand. You feel me? Let me. This shit is fuego. But I stopped doing reactions. You feel me? I'm still a little sick. <laughs> stopped doing reactions. I had to think about what I really wanted to do with this channel, um, how I wanted to prolong it. And I feel like reactions, reactions. Now, don't get me wrong. It's a good way to go. Very consistent. A lot of you build your channel quick with reactions and everything like that. Um, you build your community quick, and you get a lot of it. You get a, a shit ton of views, but you don't make any money. Well, that's the thing they don't tell you, bro. Because <laughs> everything is copyrighted, so you don't make any money doing reactions. So you could do reactions for like five, six years, and you ain't even making really a good amount of money. Even if you already are like monetized, the only way you're gonna be making good money is if your reactions are non-copyrighted and if you have sponsors. Or ads, you know what I'm saying, through your shit. To people to pay you, pretty much. So, you don't make no money doing reactions. At all. Like, the most I made doing reactions was probably like... A hundred dollars, you feel me? And that's nothing. So... I have to have a talk with myself. With my team. Myself. Yeah. It's okay, cause we can cut shit out. For me. <sighs> so, I have to have a talk with myself and my team about what I'm gonna be doing to prolong this channel. And I thought, man, like reactions. I don't know, man. I I've grown accustomed to it. I feel like I've already completed that mission. Like. 
I've already got monetized from reactions. Now, granted, I have two channels. My second channel is monetized as well, you feel me? And there, I started off, I was probably like 18, 19, and I was just doing dumb shit, bro. Like, public interviews, pranks, like dumb kid shit, you feel me? Now, I'm not really on that type of shit. I really want to, like, use my creativity and see where this channel could take me, you feel me? So, for those of y'all who've been waiting on the reaction, those y'all of y'all who are long-term subscribers who've been subscribed over a year, I only had this channel a year, you feel me? But those of y'all who've been subscribed for a year, going on a year, and um, wondering where the reactions are, I'm, I fell out of love with reactions. Not because of the money, but it's just like, it's the same routine, you know what I'm saying? Imagine... <clears throat> Imagine waking up every day, and I know this is a lot of us. This is still me damn near, but imagine waking up every day, going to the same job, doing the same exact thing every day. So say in theory, you work at, let's say you are, I'm at a Dick's right now. Let's say you work at Dick's, and your sole job is to put shoe, shoelaces in shoes. Nine to five, put shoelaces in shoes and shit. You do that every day. Same shit. Now, granted, the music was different, but the task was the same. And I feel like I wasn't really, like, tapping into my creativity like that. So I had to switch it up. You feel me? This pen is, this is so good, bro. This shit is so good. This shit is so good, bro. I'm sorry, give me one moment. This shit is like sex right now, bro. Oh. Holy shit. But yeah. But yeah. I wasn't really being creative. I was just doing what y'all told me to do. I really wasn't thinking about how I wanted to do stuff. I literally was just going through the comments seeing what y'all wanted me to react to and I would react to it, you feel me? And I just feel like that wasn't really like, I wasn't really tapping into anything, no skill set. I wasn't really trying to be great, you feel me? I was just being a robot, doing the same thing over and over and over and it gets repetitive and it starts to get easy after a while, you know what I'm saying? Not like a challenge. Now, do I know that I'm pretty much revising my whole channel? Yes, I do, you know what I'm saying? And I, and I know it's gonna take time. You feel me? I know it's gonna take time to come up everything because on average, when I was doing reactions, bro, I was probably like forty thousand views a month, which is pretty decent for somebody who's been on YouTube for like a year. You feel me? Forty thousand a month off of reactions. It's like crazy, bro. And I was getting like 200 subscribers a month. And that's how my shit grew so fast to help me get monetized so easily. Now, granted, it is certain videos that did better than others, but all in all, and I got so many collabs, like so many sponsors. It was crazy, bro. I had a guy offer me 1,400 for a, a three minute ad. Another guy offered me 700, you know what I'm saying? And I think another guy offered me like a thousand five hundred, and it was like wow, like I could throw these things in my video and get paid this much. But at the same time, my heart wasn't there. You feel me? I felt like I was just like being a slave. So I hope all y'all understand. This is why I'm not doing reactions anymore. Now, with my heart, I always be you know what I'm saying grateful for it, of course, because that helped me get monetized. Now I'm getting paid. But I'm not the type of dude to do the same thing for years and years and years, you know what I'm saying? I gotta switch it up, you feel me? That's just not who I am. That's not the type of dude I like to be. I like to always try different things, and if I fail at it, I wonder how I could do it better, and then I do do it better and I succeed at it, you feel me? It's trial and error. You can't just give up. You gotta keep going and shit, you feel me? Let me get this right quick, folks. 
That's how I look at my girl. If your man don't look at you how I look at this Panda Express, leave him, baby. Yeah, like. Oh my God, bro. Now, with that being said, I have a Patreon that I do reactions on. I still might do some reactions on Patreon. I know I got a couple subscribers. I think I still do. But I still might upload reactions to my Patreon. But I don't know yet, you know what I'm saying? I got to see where my heart is and shit. With this channel, my main focus is changing a life. Providing good content, good funny content, because my personality is like crazy. Like anybody outside, and I had to talk with my boy. His name JB, right? You feel me? I had to talk with my boy JB. I worked with him and everything. Great guy, and he just talks to me like, "Dude, start vlogging. Like your personality is fire. You funny. You charismatic. Start vlogging. Do something different." And JB been rocking with me when I first had my old channel back in like 2020. Before COVID, JB was like a, a huge supporter and shit, you know what I'm saying? And that's Mob Ties, that's the Wody right there, you feel me? But he had a talk with me, he was like... <coughs> shit. He told me, start doing vlogs, man. Start vlogging, let's go here, 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 we can do this. And he just put a bunch of ideas in my head, like... You know what? I'm not really being as creative as I could be. So why would I even start? Because all I'm doing is sitting down and I'm just reacting to videos. Now, granted, a lot of people earn a good fan base off of that, but that's not the type of person I want to be. That's not who I am and shit like that. You feel me? I don't want to just get an easy, easy income like that. You know what I'm saying? I want to grind for mine. I want to work for mine. And I don't want to have fun doing it, bro. What's the point of doing something if you ain't having fun doing it? You know what I'm saying? You were basically slave to yourself at that point. You know what I'm saying? It's already bad enough if y'all slaves to the dollar bill, but to be a slave to yourself, it's even terrible. So I'm not even going to entertain that kind of situation. I'm not going to just do something just because it's making me money. I want to do something that's going to make me happy. So I want to change the life. With this channel, I'm, I'm trying to focus on changing a life a video at a time. You feel me? One video at a time. One video at a time. I want to change somebody's life. Like, granted, am I going to be out here just throwing out money and shit? Nah, but I want to bring joy and happiness to somebody's life. So that's what my main focus is with this channel. <laughs> and having fun, man. You always got to have fun. Anything you do in life, have fun, man. Make sure you do it with a purpose. And make sure you have fun while you do it because, like I said, you don't want to be a slave to your situation or nothing like that. So make sure you have fun and shit. So, I haven't done a reaction in like two months. I want to say two or three months. Um, I hope y'all still rock with me. I know I had a lot of huge, like, reactor fans and shit like that. Subscribe to me. I haven't really seen any changes with my subscriptions. Like, anybody unsubscribing. As I check my, I check my uh, analytics daily, just to see how much money I make, and all this and all that. And my my subscribers are still growing. You know what I'm saying? I just hit 1.6. I was at 1.5 when I took my hiatus of uploading. Got 100 subscribers. You know what I'm saying? So that's still pretty good. But it's interesting to see how my channel gonna do once I stop completely reacting. You know what I'm saying I'm gonna be doing other stuff, of course, but reactions. I'm not. I'm not really messing with it right now. No, like I said before, will I eventually like? Could I fall back in love with it? Yeah, I could. But like right now, I'm just not really fucking with it. Look how good this looks, bro. If you don't think this look good, you lying to yourself, man. You should be disappointed. If you ain't eating Panda Express right now, you should be disappointed in yourself. Right, was this shit healthy? Hell no. But Sunday is a cheat day. So yeah, man. I just wanted to come in here and explain this little quick mukbang. I just wanted to come in and explain why I'm not doing reactions anymore. Now, will I always be thankful for it? Yeah, because like I said, 
And that shit got me monetized in like two, three months. Nah, I ain't gonna lie, it was like five months. And that was me uploading every day, double uploading, bangers, 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 you know what I'm saying, bringing energy. But I just was not happy with who I was. I was just a man behind the screen just listening to the music. It was nothing exciting about that for me. The songs were great. The comments was great, you know what I'm saying? Even the negative comments were still great to me. But me personally, I'm not happy if I'm just sitting in one spot doing the same thing over and over. I got to move around. I got to see different shit. I got to do different shit. I want to learn how to do different shit, you know what I'm saying? I got to be different. I can't just be stagnant. And just listen to this song and listen to that song and react to this video and that video. That's just not the type of person I am. So I hope y'all understand. Now, I know I might lose some subscribers, but that's okay. Because the day one is going to rock with me forever. Which is highly appreciated. But at the end of the day, I'm just not happy and I don't want to do anything that doesn't bring me happiness. So, like I said before, I think this is my third time saying it. I may fall back in love with reactions, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, you really don't get paid from it, but I may fall back in love with it. So I may start doing it again. But right now, I'm going to take a break from it. Um, I'm going to focus on, like I said, changing people's lives one day at a time. Um, with happiness, laughter, and just creative content, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm a creative type of dude. You feel me? I'm creative. I can pull out some whammies, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to double upload today, and I got another I got another decent video coming up after this one. So, yeah, that's the reason I don't do reactions. Like I said, it's a quick little mukbang, so I hope y'all boys appreciate it. If you unsubscribe, that's cool. If you subscribe, if you're new to that family, you got to subscribe. That's just mandatory. I look like a, man, I look like a worm or some shit, bro. PSA, this is not how I look. I shave my face, man. It's not how I look. But if you're new to the channel, make sure you stop down, drop down, go press subscribe. Once you've done subscribing, man, tap the post, know the bell so you know when I post. We got 31 days of vlogmas, man. It's day four. It's really day three, but I'm going to do a double upload for yesterday and today. And uh, we're going to get right active. Thank y'all boys so much, man. Quick little mukbang. Shout out to Panda Express. The Panda win. I only took a couple bites. I did eat earlier, but still, I'm going to dog this when I get to the crib. Shout out to Panda Wanda. Not sponsoring the video, but if you want to, go ahead DM me. You know what I'm saying? I eat there like I ain't gonna say like I'm gonna five times out the month, so I spend a good chunk of money at Panda Wanda. But yeah, man, thank y'all so much. I love y'all, and I see y'all in the next banger.